Hey, it's Dr. Adam Nally coming to you to do a short little video about cholesterol and the esterification of cholesterol. Um, and when I post on fa social media on Facebook or Instagram, a lot of times I will uh, use the uh, hashtag just keep esterifying. And a lot of people have actually messaged me saying, what is this esterification? Some people think it's related to um, drinking esters, something that related to, think it's related to, um, to estrogens. No, it's actually not. It's related to what your body does with cholesterol and how it handles cholesterol when you're either in a ketogenic state or you're in a glucose-based uh, living state. <clears throat> um, when your body uses cholesterol in the body, it takes fat and it uses the triglyceride and the cholesterol from, from that comes from the fat. As that uh, unused cholesterol from the cell is, is being recycled back to the liver, if the insulin level is high, your body will bind the um, cholesterol molecule to the outside of the lo low density lipoprotein or the LDL, the bad cholesterol. And when it's bound to the outside of the, the molecule, it actually creates a very small and a very dense particle that's actually atherogenic or causes heart disease, uh, increases the risk of heart disease or vascular disease throughout the blood vessels, specifically the arteries. If the insulin level is in the body is lower, meaning you're, you're not using carbohydrate as your fuel or you're not insulin resistant and producing between 2 and 30 times the normal amount of insulin, which is what happens with insulin, insulin resistance, check out those, uh, the, the videos that I've done on insulin resistance to understand that. Uh, when the insulin level is low, your body is able to esterify uh, or put an ester onto the cholesterol molecule and it's pulled inside of the LDL molecule. Now, these are actually... At, um, uh, beneficial and healthy for the, the blood vessels, and they actually reverse heart disease, as we're, as we're seeing. There's a study that came out in 2018 in April in the um, um, one of our medical journals that actually showed that there's a significant difference between uh, esterified cholesterol and non-esterified cholesterol, and insulin plays a, plays a, plays a role in whether that uh, cholesterol is esterified or non-esterified as it's being brought back from the cell to the liver to be recycled and used as fuel at a later date. Um, I'll show you a picture of this here. Hopefully, you can see this. Um, but uh, again, the uh, unesterified cholesterol is, is being pulled from the peripheral tissues or the tissues in the arms and legs and muscles. Um, it's, tr it's being transferred back to the liver for, for either removal or for recycling. Um, and if the insulin level is high, you're going to see those insulin molecules or that, that you're going to see the, the cholesterol molecules non-esterified, meaning the ester is not bound to them, and they are attached to the outside of the molecule, creating small, dense LDL particles, which we measure on, on either NMR testing or cardio IQ testing, depending on which lab you get your uh, cholesterol profile completed at. Um, and if the, if the insulin level is low, you're in a ketogenic state frequently or you're more often in a ketogenic state, then the likelihood of those, is those LDLs are going to be big, fluffy, or medium-sized, and they're not going to be uh, atherogenic or they're not going to put you at risk as much uh, for heart disease or stroke. So that's your little three or four minute blurb on uh, why Dr. Allen keeps saying just keep esterifying because the, the issue is you want to keep your insulin low and if your insulin level is low then you're, cre you're esterifying the cholesterol and you're creating big fluffy LDL particles and your heart disease risk is dramatically less. So check out my website docmuscles.com Check out my other videos here. Um, and if you don't have a copy of my diet, then go to docmuscles.com. I'll put a link below in the, in the article here. Docmuscles.com. Click on my diet page and get a copy of my diet that tells you how to do this, how to stay in ketosis, and how to just keep us terrifying. Take care. This is Dr. Adam Nally signing off. Have a great day. Bye-bye.